for the percentage complete type, we have three different types of percentage complete type. The first one is duration based. So if I have one activity excavation and it will take 10 days to complete, if I will go to status and I will show the start date here, I will have here duration percentage. So if I will have this 40%, so I consumed four days out of 10 days. So I have here four days elapsed and the remaining duration is six days. This is how you decipher the meaning of duration percentage. So it's based on duration. If we go back, we change it to physical and go to status again, you will find that it's not duration percentage anymore. It's a physical percentage. So it has nothing to do with duration. It has something to do with the actual amount of work that is accomplished. 40% here means I accomplished the execution of 40% of the quantity of the activity. So 40% is physically completed. So if I have here 1000 cubic meters to be excavated, I accomplished 40% of this quantity. And for the remaining duration, it is flexible right now. So I can determine exactly what is the percentage, what is the remaining duration. So maybe it's 10 days, maybe I completed 40%, but based on my current expectations, it will take only uh, four days only and it will not affect the, phys the physical percentage. But for the duration percentage, when I collect the 40%, it automatically changes to 60 days because it's uh, a function of the duration of the activity. The last percentage complete type, but it is not, it is not commonly used at all. So it's a unit, it's based on like resources consumption. So if, if I, if I allocated 10 labors and the five labors showed up at work and did some work. So I will assume it is 50% to complete it. Five labors out of 10 labors. It doesn't make sense, but Promavera gives you the option to do that. It is not used. So we use only duration or physical based on your specific needs. In the next lecture, we will talk about activity steps.